called the heroic age of exploration is of quite a short period of history. It's only just over 20 years at the tail end of the 19th century, beginning of the 20th century. And it features people like Captain Scott, Ernest Shackleton, Roald Amundsen. Um, it, great stories, fantastic uh, uh, stories of endurance, tragedy, drama. It's got everything. But interestingly enough, one of the key men in this period of history is this man, Tom Crean. But it's almost certain that most of you would never heard of him. Tom is a central figure in both Captain Scott's expedition, the one on which he died, and on the Shackleton expedition. For example, Tom is one of the last men alive to see Scott alive a few miles from the South Pole in 1912. A few months later, he goes back to the ice and buries him. Um, with the Shackleton expedition, you could, that expedition could not have taken place or been a success, the rescue operation, without Tom Crean. He was an absolute mainstay. And it was said that at times, when, when the expedition was in very dire straits, 28 men marooned a thousand miles from anywhere, no one knew, no one was coming to rescue them. Tom Cream was one of the few men that Shackleton could trust. That's the measure of the man. He was an absolute giant. He was a giant, not just physically, he was quite a big lad, but he, it was the mental strength that he had, which as you know, all, all adventurers, outdoor adventurers will know, it's the mental strength which is the most important. Tom could never speak about his exploits. And so he died and he took his story to the grave. It is an absolutely compelling and extraordinary story. And the first question you'll be asking yourself is, why haven't I heard about this man before?